Hey there everyone, Paige Martin here with this week's update. Thank you for watching. We hope everyone had a great weekend. Well, with a win on senior night, men's soccer advanced to the conference tournament, ranked as the number two seed. Rowing earned four first place finishes in the fall invitational, and football is now tied for first place in the West Division after the 45-24 victory against East Carolina. With running backs James Landers and D'Angelo Brewer, Tulsa is the only team in the country with two players both averaging 100 plus rushing yards per game. Whew, shout out to that offensive line. And to wrap things up for us, on Sunday, the volleyball team improved to a four-game winning streak after a big victory over first place Cincinnati. That's all I have for you all this week. Now let's go ahead and pass it over to Corey Hates to preview this week's forecast. Thanks, Paige. Here's our weekly forecast. On Thursday, volleyball has a game against USF at 7 p.m. They're on a four-game winning streak, so hopefully everybody can come out and support. It's also going to be a pajama party. I'll be there in my onesie. I hope to see everybody else there in their onesie. Um, on Friday, men's basketball plays against Jacksonville State at 7 p.m. It's the season opener, and the first 400 students get a t-shirt. Come out and support. On Saturday, women's volleyball follows it up with UCF at 1 p.m. I hope everybody is there. Have a great week.